for us the lightning flashes and lights up the whole sky from one side to the other so will the son of man be in his day so from one side to the other lightning flashes the same way the son of man will come in his day when he comes on the second coming of jesus he will come at an unexpected moment like a flash flashing of lightning okay verse 25 but first he must endure much suffering and be rejected by this generation first he has to die the son of man has to die he is jesus is prophesying about for um, for seeing is about his uh, crucifixion verse 26 just as it was in the days of noah so too will be in the days of the son of man so what happened during the time of noah noah's time nobody knew that there is going to be a flood everyone was busy enjoying eating drinking traveling having partying and all these things they don't even think of god they are not worried about god they don't even go to church or not not praying not sacrifice nothing except noah and family all the others were enjoying they were not spiritual they were fully worldly except one family that is noah's family just it was just as it was in the days of noah so too will be in the time in the days of the son of man that means when the second coming of jesus will happen the same situation will be there what does it mean the whole world will be busy eating drinking selling buying marrying and all the enjoyment entertainment nobody will be interested about god no one will be thinking about god no one will be believing in god everyone will be forgetting about god all these things will happen only a remnant of israel only a remnant a small number of people will be there holding on to jesus believing in jesus and and waiting for the second coming of jesus just like what happened to the time of flood and noah the same thing is going to happen at the second coming of jesus this is already prophesied by jesus my dear brothers and sisters if you look around in this world you can see the more the world is increasing the less the faith in god people are denouncing god denouncing religion and forgetting about going to the church the churches and cathedrals and shrines are being closed down and sold for pubs and hotels people are abandoning god youth and youngsters are not believing in god atheism is increasing this is already prophesied jesus knew it already bible already prophesied it this is going to happen this is already happening 27 just as it, okay they were eating drinking marrying being given in marriage until the day noah entered the ark and the flood came and destroyed all of them they were busy with their business but only noah was work building up the temple building up the ark the ark is the symbol of the church in the church all varieties of the nationalities races and everyone the same way ark is the symbol of the church and noah was busy building up the ark when the whole world was enjoying so in the days of coming of jesus second coming of jesus we should be busy building up of the church and we will be said all those who work for the church all those who work for the building of the church the building of the church means the church is the mystical body of christ all those who work towards the building of church all the charism gifts and of the holy spirit which god has given you it is for the building up of the church not for your personal building of your business so it is building up of the church so all those who are busy building up of the church will be saved praise the lord so this is what about the noah let's continue verse 28 likewise just as it was in the days of lot you know what happened to lot lot is the half brother of abraham and he was in sodom and gomorrah sodom and gomorrah was the place where all kinds of evil practices were taking place homosexual unions sexual perversions living together without any sacrament and all kinds of sinful habits and it was taking place in sodom and gomorrah 
they were eating drinking buying selling planting building but only one family lot and family welcomed the angels of god in their family only one family were thinking of god only one family eight of them eight family members only eight of them they were thinking of god welcoming god they were talking to the angels of god and they were interceding for the whole country only one family and all the others were busy with all their worldly life then what happened was 20 and but on the day that lord lot left sodom it rained fire and sulfur from heaven and destroyed all of them except this family my dear brothers and sisters even today if you go to this place you will see the whole land full of sulfur so all those who wish, uh, visited holy land if you go to the sodom and gomorrah if you just go around you can collect sulfur everywhere the whole land is full of sulfur and also big stones of salt and one of which is called the wife of lot we read verse that 30 we read verse 30 it will be like that on that day that the son of man is revealed just like these people will be falling into all kinds of sexual sins especially homosexuality sin of homosexuality and all the other things people will be busy with all these things all the perversions and everyone will be fighting for their right right and forget the right the real right and everyone will be busy with their own world enjoying no connection with god not thinking of god not going to the church no practice of the spiritual activities everyone will be in their world and suddenly just like the sulfur and fire came upon sodom and gomorrah at an unexpected moment only one family escaped from that city that is the the family of lot the same way the son of man will be revealed reveal revelare or re revelation or apocalypse this is where the word apocalypse comes from this word revealed praise the lord hallelujah thank you jesus